Hi and welcome to this edition of Out of the Box. My name is Paul. Today we're going to have a look at what's in this nondescript box. This is actually a Tycon PoE um, converter. This happens to be um, a 24 volt to uh, 48 volt 100 megasecond converter, but they're actually very similar across the whole range. So we'll use this to show you really what these are about. So let me show you what you're gonna get in the box. You get the item, which we'll have a look at in a moment, um, and you're gonna get your wiring diagram. Let me try and find the best way to hold that up for you. Um, this is actually a little bit bigger on this side and this side here. So what is this? It's a multi-voltage input device that will then give you 24 volts or 48 volts, depending on which model you purchase. What's the idea of this? Well, some people are running 24 volt battery power. Some people are running 12 volt battery power. And often we need to get out to either 24 volts, um, which is common for many of the Ubiquiti uh, Air Max products if we're doing point to points, um, or out to 48 volts, which is our standard uh, for PoE, which most cameras and wireless access points and that type of thing work out. So maybe you're down at the gate, you want to connect to camera, but you've only got 12 volt battery power or you've only got 24 volt um, battery power and you need to get up to 48 volts. This is the 48 volt model, like I said. So let me show you. So on this side here, we've got our terminal block for our power in. Um, this will generally take, each model's different, um, it can take from um, 9 volts to 36 volts input. Um, this one here, uh, let me have a look. Uh, this one will actually take 36 to 76 volts input. All right, so like I said, this gives us out uh, 48 volts. Um, so obviously, maybe you're running a higher output system in DC, um, then this would be there. If you're going to choose another model that we can take down to between nine and 36 volts. So again, if you've got a 12 volt battery array or a 24 volt battery array, you can use this terminal block in, all right, that's gonna give you a power. It's then gonna be converted depending on which model of these you've purchased to either 48 volts or 24 volts. We're going to have our in, we often call that our LAN port. That's where our data is coming from, a network switch, your point to point connection, whatever it might be. All right, and then we've got our PoE port here. Um, and so that's going to now take out our power and our data. Maybe that's to a PO, um, a point-to-point -point device, or maybe it's actually going to be to a wireless access point or some other device, uh, a camera that you've got connected. So a really versatile, make sure you get the right model for what you need, um, but you'll see a number of different options of these, 48 volts out or 24 volts out, and a multiple of options here for power uh, in um, and then you can get these in one gig or 100 meg. So a really good versatile unit to hit what you need where you've got a battery setup or a solar array. So do head on over to our YouTube channel. We've got loads more box openings on wireless network and firewall devices. So do subscribe and stay up to date.